Hello friends. In this video you will see how the cast in the movie Everybody Hates Chris 2005 has changed. The movie is about a young African American teen attempting to survive with his dysfunctional family and his all white school in the 1980s. I'll show you what they looked like in 2005 and what's happening to them now in 2023 after 18 years. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go. Hey everybody. Hey. I got a surprise. A Betamax. Didn't they stop making those? They sure did. John Saxon played the role of Roper in the film Enter the Dragon. John Saxon was an American actor who worked on more than 200 film and television projects during a span of 60 years. He was known for his work in westerns and horror films. As a, as a kid, I mean, first of all, I was filled with rage. I, I, Often playing police officers and detectives. Okay, fine. You do it later. I will. Okay. I am. Good. Rochelle, portrayed by Takana Arnold, is the strong-willed and outspoken mother of Chris Rock's character. She is a no-nonsense woman who is determined to keep her family in line and make sure they have a better life. Rochelle's strict parenting style and sassy attitude often lead to comedic moments and memorable one-liners throughout the show. In January 2016, Arnold's representative confirmed she and Hines were divorcing. Because singing was my first gift uh -huh. that I discovered, that's when I realized, okay, um, singing's not... The media reported that Hines had been unfaithful to Arnold, having made a sex tape with another woman during their marriage. Woo! Not in the glass, boy! People gotta drink from that! Okay, I dare you. Drew, portrayed by Tequan Richmond, is Chris Rock's younger brother. Drew is confident, popular, and often seen as the cool sibling. He dreams of becoming a singer and is often seen practicing his moves and showcasing his talent. Despite his charm, Drew sometimes finds himself caught up in Christmas adventures. Richmond has also starred in the film Nowhere, Michigan, in which he was a first-time producer. You know, he's like on the fence about everything. He's always trying to see one side happy and the other side happy. But uh, season two. What do you think about Drew character? Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Now this is good. Isn't it good, baby? Can I have some cake? You can have some sausage. I told you. Tanya, portrayed by Imani Hakim, is Chris Rock's younger sister. Tanya is a sassy and assertive girl with a strong personality. She often challenges authority figures, including her parents and teachers. Tanya is known for her quick wit and sharp tone, providing comedic moments throughout the show. Yeah, it's really refreshing to know that not only do we have a very diverse cast, we have four women a part of the main cast. Hakim follows a vegan diet. She enjoys painting in her free time. Hey Greg, what's up? My father's going out of town for a week. I have to stay with my grandmother. Not like Robert Allen Wall played the character O'Hara in the film Into the Dragon. He was an American actor and martial artist. Wall was born on August 22, 1939 in San Jose, California to Ray Wall, a construction worker and Reva Wall, a nurse. While in high school, he took up wrestling. Wall attended San Jose State University on a scholarship and later moved to Southern California. I'm an actor, but I, uh, I to pretend to be other people, uh, and it's a lot of fun, and I'm going to talk to you guys kind of about that today. He joined the film at the age of 34. He died in 2022 at the age 83. Ah! Ouch! Ouch! Where my lucky socks? Who took my lucky socks? Chris, portrayed by Tyler James Williams, is the main character and the younger version of comedian Chris Rock. The show follows Chris' experiences growing up in a tough neighborhood and attending a predominantly white school. Chris is smart, resilient, and often finds himself in hilarious and challenging situations, dealing with both racial and comedic undertones. There's a whole man that steps out of Big Bird and that, <laughs> whoo, that first time, it'll get to you. He was raised in Yonkers, New York, and began acting at the age of just four. You can say that again. What do you mean? Chris, what do you want to do when you get out of school? You know, you got about as much direction as a broken compass. The narrator, voiced by comedian Chris Rock himself, provides commentary and insights into the events of his childhood. The narrator adds humor and perspective to the story, often highlighting the irony and absurdity of the situations Chris finds himself in, making the show even more entertaining. In 2012, Rock settled a lawsuit with allegations of sexual abuse. 
It was, whoa, the last party at the White House. First of all, you, you've been to the White House? Yes. It's amazing. Rock was not charged with the crime and has denied that the rape ever occurred. Nice shoes, BoJ. I don't play that. I'm from bed boy. I'll bring half a... Joey Caruso, portrayed by Travis T. Flory, is a classmate and recurring antagonist to Chris. Joey is known for being a troublemaker, often taunting and bullying Chris. Despite his mischievous behavior, Joey occasionally shows moments of vulnerability, revealing a more complex character beneath his tough exterior. What do you think about Joey Caruso character? Don't forget to share and subscribe to the channel. Time of year must be hard for your fam. No? I know. Ms. Morello, portrayed by Jacqueline Mazzarella, is Chris Strict and no-nonsense teacher. Ms. Morello is known for her tough disciplinary methods and high expectations for her students. While initially portrayed as strict, she occasionally shows moments of compassion and understanding, revealing a deeper side to her character. Jackie has a Bachelor of Arts in Philosophy from Johns Hopkins University. I've gotten like really lovely and then some like, okay, I'm not giving you my <laughs> shoe size. <laughs> Originally from New Jersey, she now lives in Los Angeles. Dude from across the street. Check you out, man. <laughs> See, man, you got a cop a lean. Pop your collar up a little bit. Kevin Tate Jackson was born on February 26, 1982 in Los Angeles, California, USA. He is an actor and production manager known for Everybody Hates Chris, 2005, CSI, New York, 2004, and The Shield, 2002. What do you think about Jerome character? I'm here because her insecurities are driving me crazy in tune driving her crazy. Don't forget to comment and subscribe to the channel. It's a baby to honor the mother and the father, and if the father should meet a tragic death. Mr. Omar, portrayed by Ernest Lee Thomas, he had a recurring role as funeral director, is Chris next door neighbor. Mr. Omar is an eccentric and quirky character known for his unique fashion sense and friendly demeanor. Yeah, major depression, more drugs, because Coke, I haven't introduced to Coke at that time, and Remy Martin. He often provides comedic relief and serves as a source of advice and wisdom for Chris and his family. <laughs> Jerry's Lee Poindexter, born December 22nd, 1950. Jerry's Poindexter was born on December 22nd, 1950 in Los Angeles, California, is actor, comedian, and musician. He is known for his recurring role as Kill Moves on the UPN slash the CW sitcom Everybody Hates Chris. What do you think about Kill Moves' character? Uh, basically about uh, people coming back home after the hurricane Katrina. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Welcome to Huda Channel on YouTube, the place where we compile the most famous Hollywood actors in the movies. We are delighted to share with you interesting changes of movie stars from the time they started in the movie until now. With our passion for movies, we hope that our videos will help you understand more about your favorite actors and the movies they have participated in. Let's explore the very interesting changes over time of Hollywood stars with Huda Channel.